started off mm. as uh, brothers before we were, you know, people in the industry. Um, although that's where we met. So, wala namang competition. There's no, there's no thoughts about that. It's just a true friendship that we all have, which I'm really yeah, happy to say. Yeah, can I just put that out there? Can we stop comparing uh, people? Because Edward and I are brothers and we'll always be brothers. Started off mm. as uh, brothers before we were, you know, people in the industry. Um, although that's where we met. So, wala namang competition. There's no, there's no thoughts about that. It's just, a true friendship that we all have, which I'm really yeah, happy to say. Yeah, can I just put that out there? Can we stop comparing uh, people? Because Edward and I are brothers and we'll always be brothers. For me personally, I'll share it straight up and I'm not afraid of saying this. And mm-hmm. one of the people that really helped me open up emotionally, especially on set, is usually your your co-actor or co-actress. And that for me was, was my my. For me personally, I'll share it straight up and I'm not afraid of saying this and mm-hmm. one of the people that really helped me open up emotionally especially on set is usually your your co-actor or co-actress and that for me was was my my she'll really prepare for a scene but not too much because she still wants that spontaneity Organic. which is good oh, yeah you know, that, I like that, that. It's like you can prepare for a scene, but then when you over prepare, it, it, it will look too rehearsed. Tata. She has that, like, I ayo ko muna magbasa kasi mamaya gusto ko ibigay ng kung paano ko ibibigay. Diba? So, may ganun factor. Wow. Uh, I mean, ano I, I, how, do you, how do you feel about that, bro? Are you, are you that person who likes to prepare or rehearse or ikaw? Yeah, it's, it's a mix of both. Mix of both. Again, the reason I was asking that is because ganyan na ganyan din si Mai Mai. Uh, I have a yeah. habit of overthinking and over-preparing and there's always... Si Mai Mai minsan nag-chill lang doon. Nagkwekwentuhan sa mga artists. She'll really prepare for a scene but not too much. Because she still wants that spontaneity, Organic. which is good. Oh, yeah. Spontaneity. You know, that, I like that. that. It's like you could prepare for a scene, but then when you over prepare, it, it, it will look too rehearsed. Tata. She has that, like, I ayo ko muna magbasa kasi mamaya gusto ko ibigay ng kung paano ko ibibigay. Diba? So, may ganun factor. Wow. Uh, I mean, ano I, I, how, do you, how do you feel about that, bro? Are you, are you that person who likes to prepare or rehearse or ikaw? Yeah, it's, it's a mix of both. Mix of both. Again, the reason I was asking that is because ganyan na ganyan din si Mai Mai. Uh, I have a yeah. habit of overthinking and over-preparing and there's always... Si Mai Mai minsan nag-chill lang doon. Nagkwekwentuhan sa mga artists. You're on the verge of being ready for, you know, more mature roles. Yung mature roles, mga kapamilya, doesn't mean <laughs> mga bed scenes. Yung mga ganyan. Yeah, that's so it just funny. means Whatever. Just Whatever older, so older and roles. And you can mature yeah. roles. And I'm like, meaning... <laughs> <laughs> Kailangan clarify. You're on the verge of being ready for, you know, more mature roles. Yung mature roles, mga kapamilya, doesn't mean <laughs> mga bed scenes. Yung mga ganyan. Yeah, that's so it just funny. means whatever. Just whatever older, older, is, older and roles. And yeah. mature roles. And I'm like, meaning? <laughs> <laughs> Kailangan clarify. All right, we can get ikaw, on with bro, the question. Ikaw, bro, an- anong, anong age ka, ano? Anong age mo gusto magsettle? Dude, when I'm like I'm I'm 20 years old right now. I I do personally yeah. think by around age 28, uh, 28. I would like to yeah I, I, by 28 I would prefer to be already married honestly. Um, oh really? Yeah, I I, I want to be married by 30. But uh, again, I know from my magagalit yung ate ko dito. But she always gives herself <laughs> deadlines. So she's saying yeah, in date by 26 years old. Uh, I want to be married by this age, so I have to know the guy by this age. This, when you do that, there's just so much stress. Um, because yeah, you don't have control. Mayun. So just, I'm going to take a page out of Donnie's book and just relax, enjoy the ride. All right, we can get ikaw, on with bro, the questions. Ikaw, bro, an- anong, anong age ka, ano? Anong age mo gusto mag-settle? Dude, when I'm, like, I'm, I'm 20 years old right now. I, I do personally yeah. think by around age 28. Uh, I would like to, yeah. I, I, by twenty eight, I would prefer to be already married. Honestly. Um, oh really? Yeah. I I, I want to be married by thirty. But 
again, I know from my <laughs> magagalit yung ate ko dito, but she always gives herself <laughs> deadlines. So sinasabi niya, in de- by 26 years old, uh, I want to be married by this age, so I have to know the guy by this age. This, when you do that, there's just so much stress. Um, because yeah, wala talaga sa control mo yun. So just, I'm going to take a page out of Donnie's book and just relax, enjoy the ride. Fully. I'm absolutely curious. Yeah, yeah. Like, uh, uh, social media, the toxicity. Uh, what do you feel, bro? What do you feel? Um, genuinely, it's it's one of those things na without getting too like emotional about it because uh, we, we all go through that emo- those emotions but nakaka nakakasawa <laughs> you know na nawawala yung saya minsan um sa pagiging artista um when these things come in so there'll be a lot of like so the way that I will personally handle it sometimes is that I won't use social media then other people will complain that I'm not posting a lot so it's just like well it's it's an environment that of course we can't change um and all of that but when i see my friends getting bashed when i can't have a proper conversation like the, one of the the main thing is i don't like how careful i have to be with my words when i talk to donnie like i love like when if yeah. you guys see the way that donnie and i talk off cam it, we're just having fun all the time um yung sense of humor niya is sarcasm yung sa akin sarcasm din so we will make a lot of jokes that don't mean anything but of course, if we're if we're seen online saying it, parang it, it's always difficult. So I just love having fun with my friends, and I don't want there to be an elephant in the room every time I I talk to my friends and I talk to Donnie. So again, please stop. We're That's all family. The, we're all friends. Yeah, and we just like want to have fun said, together. Exactly, a lot is said on social media that isn't true. I, I'm absolutely curious. Yeah, yeah, like uh, uh, social media, the toxicity. Uh, what do you feel, bro? What do you feel? Um, genuinely, it's it's one of those things. Na without getting too like emotional about it, because uh, we, we all go through that emo- those emotions. Pero nakaka yeah. nakasawa, <laughs> you know, na nawawala yung saya minsan um, sa pagiging artista um, when these things come in. So. There'll be a lot of like so the way that I will personally handle it sometimes is that I won't use social media. Then other people will complain that I'm not posting a lot. So it's just like, well, it's it's an environment that of course we can't change. Um and all of that. But when I see my friends getting bashed, when I can't have a proper conversation, like the one of the the main thing is I don't like how careful I have to be with my words when I talk to Donnie. Like I love like when yeah. if you guys see the way that Donnie and I talk off cam, it, we're just having fun all the time. Um, yung sense of humor niya is sarcasm. Yung sa akin sarcasm din. So we will make a lot of jokes that don't mean anything. But of course, if we're if we're seen online saying it, parang it, it's always difficult. So I just love having fun with my friends, and I don't want there to be an elephant in the room every time I I talk to my friends and I talk to Donnie. So. Again, please stop. We're all That's family. The, we're all friends. Yeah. And we just like want to have fun said, together. Yeah. Exactly. A lot is said on social media that isn't true. And something that I did want to talk to you about today is social media has reached a, a, a different level of, I wanna, I'm going to say straight out toxicity, uh, especially recently. And um, I really wanted to clear it up because... Where is it going to start if it's not the two of us or if it's not For you sure. know, the people involved? Bring it the on. People who are at the center of it. Because yeah. wala, very recently, guys, and dami namin nakikita, nakikita na mga bashing out of nowhere, toxicity out of nowhere. And um, I wanted to ask you straight up, Donnie, how do you feel about it? There's just so many different things and it's it's just not okay. So how do you feel about all of it? Well, the toxicity sucks. There's no other way to put it, you know? public figures this is something that's probably gonna be in our lives for a while (laughs) as long as we're still here in showbiz that's what we have to accept um but i just want to you know set things right now set it straight edward my my queer robbie these are this squad these are some of the closest people i have in showbiz and I don't like it when we're pinned against each other and when there's competition. 
because we yeah we're we're a family but there's also this type of respect that we have for each other so when someone's bashing edward when someone's bashing me obviously like i get hurt and i'm sure edward feels the same so yeah i say right now, we're all friends guys i really really want to stress that we're all friends stop the fan wars please stop let's respect each other i obviously have projects aligned um they are set already a lot of them with bell edward has a lot of them with my my let's respect that and something that i did want to talk to you about today is social media has reached a a, a different level of i want to, i'm going to say straight out toxicity uh, especially recently and um i really wanted to clear it up because where is it going to start if it's not the two of us or if it's not For you sure. know the people involved bring it the on people who are of it because yeah well uh, very recently guys and dami namin nakikita, nakikita na mga bashing out of nowhere toxicity out of nowhere and um i wanted to ask you straight up donnie how do you feel about it there's just so many different things and it's it's just not okay so how do you feel about all of it well the toxicity sucks there's no other way to put it you know public figures this is something that's probably going to be in our lives for a while <laughs> as long yeah. as we're still here in showbiz that's what we have to accept um but i just want to you know set things right now set it straight edward my my kuya robby these are this squad these are some of the closest people i have in showbiz and i don't like it when we're pinned against each other and when there's competition because we yeah we're we're a family but there's also this type of respect that we have for each other so when someone's bashing edward when someone's bashing me obviously like i get hurt and i'm sure edward feels the same so yeah i'll say right now, we're all friends guys i really really want to stress that we're all friends stop the fan wars please stop let's respect each other i obviously have projects aligned Um, they are set already. A lot of them with Bell. Edward has a lot of them with Mai Mai. Let's respect that.